Wauwatosa girls with the power to halt a train in its tracks. Thanks to them, the Canadian Pacific Holiday Train will make a stop in Tosa in December. Katie Crowther has more on how they did it. How exciting, Katie. Yeah, it really is, Carol. You know, they were standing right here near the train tracks in downtown Wauwatosa last year when the holiday train rolled right past them. It made stops in Milwaukee and Heartland. Well, they made it their mission to get it to stop here in Wauwatosa, and they got right to work. The holiday train is a sight to behold, but 13-year-old Girl Scouts Michaela Miller and Madison Sviam wanted a longer glimpse. So we did a little bit more research and found out why it stopped. They wrote a letter to Canadian Pacific and found out the train stops in places that organize donations for food banks. So Michaela and Madison reached out to Tosa Cares, which helps feed local families in need. Finding out that there was a food need in Wow Tosa was really big. I guess I just didn't realize it, especially like in my own school district. Like I might even pass these kids in the hallway some days. Once Canadian Pacific was on board with the girls' plan, the two of them had to rally the support of Wauwatosa city business and safety leaders. There's a lot that you don't think of that needs to be planned. Now, these seventh graders are conducting all holiday train city planning meetings. Any updates that you guys had from the last meeting? Together, they put this project on track, but the journey taught them more than they ever expected. It's fun to see how much we can do. We didn't necessarily realize how much we could do. I feel like it's really taught us that there's more to the world and more to life than just yourself. And the train stops here in downtown Wauwatosa this year on December 4th at 8.15 p.m. And that actually also corresponds with the city's tree lighting that night. So mark your calendars. It's going to be a good night here in Tosa.